do, 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 do. Have you been playing at Academy? Do you like it? I enjoyed the demo. Okay, it ain't this one. This is our undead fortress, right? Yeah, this is the everything comes back from the dead fortress. Which is actually doing fine. Well, we haven't come back to this one, but it's doing okay. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. Continue active game. Alright, it's not in for dimensions. Circus contained. Wall them in. Oh no. I remember that for it. It's probably Lance Joy. You named the creation specifically for this reason. I'll have to do that from now on. <laughs> but we finally turned on the game you wanted. Here we are. Alright, for those that weren't here at the start of this fort, the idea is we're gonna build an ocean fortress. We're making a massive platform out here that we're gonna build up on. And I'm also thinking, quite monstrously, that we're gonna have crippling class inequality. We're gonna we're gonna make like luxury homes for the administrators and the royalty out here. And then in like the horrible crap hole under the mountain, we'll have all the workers. The game doesn't have a function for them to uh, rise up and topple their oppressors, but we can maybe just roleplay that happening at some point. <laughs> Will you sever the bridge? If we cut the bridge, it would kill all the wealthy people, because I believe all of this would just collapse. So that is a distinct possibility. As a little quick tour for everybody. We basically just have a little little tavern situation over here, drinks, lodging, lodging. That's where we store our uh, our cooked food. Got a little little kitchen cooking food here. It sounds like it's by design. It might be by design. Angry mouths. I can, I can see that a little bit. I wish you could use the driftwood. It would be a really nice way to take advantage of resources. But I would like to get the fort bigger so that we could, like, weather some assaults. It'd be fun, like... Have just a bridge with some traps and, like, knock people into the ocean. Just, like, spinning... Spinning nonsense on the bridge to knock people off would be fun. Make a fortify right there. Anyway, as I said on the first floor, got a little well here. We go down, got some nice water. Ooh, does someone make a masterpiece? Ah, a Gabbro amulet. Well done. Breaking news, disgruntled dwarf sinks fortress. <laughs> they have an easy solution when we want to seize the means of production. Merchants are leaving. Mole dogs are fighting. <coughs> <coughs> Migrants have finally arrived. I've been struggling to get migrants. If anything shows up that spreads fire, your fort's going up and then down at once. I love the water solution. I really like that we took advantage of a stupid aquifer for a change. I also would like to make some sort of... underground... underwater tunnel up into the fort, but that might be very difficult to do. But like, I'm just kind of doing exploratory digs to see if we can figure out how deep the ocean goes. So far, like, minus five, I believe, is... Yeah, minus five is under the ocean. Already, and there's no water. I thought that seven meant it was seven tiles deep of water, but no. No, no. Not the way it works. Alright, farming's going well. Honestly, it's a shockingly stable fortress, given how stupid it is. Uh, stray horse, wild boars fighting. Who's fighting a wild boar? I don't see a wild boar. 
Nothing there. Oh well. Uh, I want to disassemble the wagon. Remove this building. We have places for most of those things, right? Finished trade goods go there. We got food set up. Building materials are underneath our workshops. So right here. All conveniently stored in bins. Love bins. And what kind of stuff we got? Hematite? We'll definitely like more hematite. Hematite. Ah, oh, this is the edge of the map. We can't actually get that hematite. Wish there was a way to place structures down a Z level into water. Yeah, me too. And we're in like a warm climate, so we can't even do the trick where you just wait for the water to freeze. I do love this music, though. Wasn't I doing something down in the caverns? Oh, yeah, I was starting to get a trash chute planned. We have this big open pit directly above. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good. Oh, the courts. Rim Taratek. Herbalist has created Nakima Magaz. Boom on a Vandal. A Galena bracelet. She offers it to the even glazes. I didn't even notice someone did a mysterious construction. Let's go look at it. This is a Galena bracelet. All crafts to our ship is of the highest quality. This object's adorned with hanging rings of Galena and menaces with spikes of Galena. It's valued at roughly 2750 Not the most valuable. In the Lake Town Fort, you did use DF hack to make piers. We're going pure vanilla. We're going to make this work. Ish. Work ish. It takes ages to make this platform, and they're using all kinds of materials to do it. We got basalt floors. Why is this open space? What's going on? They keep on canceling some of these. We have oak and logs, iron, copper, iron. Hopefully they don't use too much good materials. I told them to mostly do wood. Yeah, it looks like we're back to wood. Uh, construction, floor, select the material. Thank you very much. Hmm. I mean, I got Gabbro. I'll use some Gabbro. I would like it to be wood, but you gotta use what you got. Mica? Yeah, use some mica. Like, I feel like I have plenty of wood, but most of that's probably that wood. Anyway, back down we go. We got a stray dog. Hunter is hunting. Down, 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 down. What we got here? Semi-molten rock. I'm guessing that's semi-molten rock. Oh yeah, lots of lava here. Semi-molten. Question is, can we see any of that good, good circus wall? Uh, cancelled. Oh, we don't have enough logs for charcoal. That's the big thing we're doing down in the caverns right now, is just finding... Ooh, native gold. Finding and chopping down trees. Ah, uh, it's completely underwater. There's no way they'll be able to get to these trees. No way. All right, we'll cancel that. As much as I want wood, these dum-dums would drown for sure. I could just, like, tell them to crack into that 
crack into that wall and flood the molten cavern with water. That feels like it would be bad for me. I want to just have them dump garbage into a chute that goes all the way down into the lava land. The perfect way to get rid of garbage. If you accidentally find the circus, we could send the ocean to them. I'm starting to think the ocean's not that impressive. Like, depth-wise, it's not that deep. I'm kind of surprised. Because I was also thinking, like, yeah, I could just crack a hole in the ocean and drain it into the lava. Into the caverns. But it looks like it wouldn't give us that much water. I wonder if it produces water like, um... Like the aquifer, the light aquifer does. Because I filled that pit just by taking advantage of how aquifers kind of leak water. Come on. Come on. Can't take the credit though. That was that was Taco who taught me that trick. Come on. Come on, baby. You could do it. You could do it, yes. You're almost there. Come on. Ah, there we go. Mm -hmm. It'd come in from the edge of the map at a high rate, but you've never done it yourself. I mean, we could... As a experiment we could try just mining the ocean Doo -doo. any trees over here not that I see looking for that good fungus wood oh 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 Chop that down. We can get access to that. It's just a nice, simple, straight line. There we go. Now they can get to a little ramp down, and they should be able to get to and chop down that tree. How about over here? Nope, I got a couple already marked for chopping over there. Same deal. Just go ahead and cut our way in. Opens a portal hell to use a sump pump. Gotta be... If you're gonna be one thing, you should be efficient. <laughs> and what's more efficient than that? What are these naked mole puppies? We could probably domesticate naked mole, mole dogs. I don't know for sure, but, like, I think it might be possible. Chop that tree down and that tree down. You can, okay? Let's see. Can we gain easy access into... Into that portion of the caverns? Do, 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 do. Just making sure every every <coughs> possible source of wood <coughs> is marked <coughs> for harvest, and that we have a means of reaching them. That's good. We still got a small fire going on over here. Love to get some more migrants. Uh, is there anything I need from that section? Oh, oh. Hello, Tower Cat. Chop it down. Well, interesting. All right, it is marked already. We're just way up. We're so high up. All right, I feel like we're pretty interconnected with these caverns at this point. Now we just wait for a forgotten beast to show up and we'll all die. All right, 
which project is getting worked on the most. Probably this, which is good. This is the important one. Nice rough mica floor. It's gonna be real ugly. I do kind of- I'm kind of happy they're making like stripes. They've really just chosen like this is gonna be granite over here. I don't know how and why they made these decisions. But good for them. I like it. Ooh, is that a new tree? Did a new tree grow? Wait. Man, I don't know how trees work sometimes. Like, this is marked for being chopped, but I can't chop the actual base of it? You're a formidable tree. I could dig underneath it and just collapse the earth under it. I'm pretty sure that would kill the dwarf. Same thing here. Is it because there's a piece of it marked for chopping? And that's like fucking with the... Fucking with the game? Yeah, that might have been it. There we go. Those are two new big trees that we're about to get some wood from. Good, good, yes. And soon the trash pit will be a chute going straight down into hell. Cut jam's been completed. Winter is upon us. In this warm, warm area. Should we have a military one day? Eh. Alright, farm's coming along. Everything's nice and stable, and people are not happy per se, but they're not miserable. 28. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. We have 22 people's worth of housing. We should probably get a little bit more going. Ba, ba, ba. Ooh, move my microphone a little bit for easy typing. A happy dwarf is an over overworked dwarf. Here, make me ten more beds. We're doing barracks style for these guys until we have the fort on the ocean going. And that's where we'll put nice places. For the wealthy and important dwarves. Classism will be the theme. It'll be terrible. There we go. This weirdly shaped area will be where more bedrooms will be made. I'm starting to think I need more people mining? Adequate professional master and legendary. We only have four people on the mining job. What other folks in here? Hunter, ranger, a fish cleaner, animal caretaker, stone crafter. I don't think I need two animal caretakers. Oh, just a peasant? Start mining. If I have the picks. I wonder how many picks I have. I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Excellent. Your new mouse? Is it a house mouse? Hey-ho! <laughs> Is there anything else we need for the generalized fort here? More bedrooms, we're taking care of that. As opposed to a field mouse? Yeah! Or like one of those little kangaroo mice? Those are really cool. We got more guinea pigs, more horses. 
All right, I might as well train animals. We got people that are good at it. There's two people with animal handling in there. Hunting training and combat training. That's what we'll get. We have like a puppy somewhere, right? Do 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 do. Asus ROG Spatha X. It'll give your impressions in Discord once you used it for a while. Yeah, let me know. I tend to be a Logitech person. Like, I really enjoy the, the G line of Logitech and mice. I'm using a G500S currently. I've been using some variants on this line for ages. Make rock mug, construct building, harvest plant, construct, 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 construct. You know? I think I might make it so that some of my miners only do mining. Legendary miner, you only mine. Master miner, you only mine. That way at least I'm always getting some digging going. Sheriff, Hammer, Manager, Medical Dwarf, Broker, Bookkeeper. You've gone through three MX Master Mice. You like them, but you'd rather get another and have a break? That's fair. Like, I enjoy the, the particular mice I mentioned because I've been using the same ones or some variants on them for years and years, and they tend to last a long time without breaking. Hospital, just in case. But it would need to be somewhere down here where I could have the well reach the right spot. Sparse dead floor fungus, open space. Good, the water is like another tile down. So I could put the hospital here, and the well would be able to reach there. Okay. Nice little hospital. Perfect. Like this, this is water. This is open space, so water won't come pouring in. Good, good, good. Let's put a door there. And now I just need to channel on down. Are you there? Do, 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 do. And that'll get us access to the water here as well. Never seen the appeal of Razor or Corsair or any of them. Yeah. I really enjoy, like, extra buttons on my mice. 
And typically the razor mice have like one or two. But I never like the positioning of them. Again, I really like the shape and feel of my uh, G500. Like it fits the hand very, very comfortably, very well. Ah, oh, we need more blocks. Make ten rock blocks. And we don't have beds yet. Oh, I'll still designate it as a hospital, even if it's not ready yet. Hospital. There we go. The mountainous home. It's not a ready hospital, but it's designated as such. Slap another door down. Oh god, we need more doors. Dude! Make me ten more rock doors. I feel like maybe I need a few more workshops just to help things come along. This guy's cutting gems. Make wood barrel, smelting, crafts, and mugs. Doo -doo -dee -dee -doo -doo. Make bed, make rock block, and make door. Haven't been approved yet. It's a chunker, it's a big, a big mice, big mouse, big boy mouse. This work order has not been validated by the manager. The manager could be employed. You know, if he had an office, this would go a lot faster. Should probably do that. Even bigger than the MX Master. Wait, buttons it's got. Got all buttons on there. And animals become a stray. Oh, we got a hunting dog and a war dog now. Struck clear termaline. All right, now that we have dedicated miners, I'm thinking some of our underground projects are coming along a lot faster. Yep. Really, I'm shocked. What is this big open space? Come on. Micah, Micah, Micah. Gabro. Gabro, Gabro. Guessing like some stuff got used by other things. This is really just taking up all of my dwarves this time. The construction of our giant ocean platform. Once it's there, we'll be ready. Ooh! A metal worker's withdrawn from society. Who? Who is it? Kib. Where's Kib? Hopefully he gets everything he needs. I was out in the rain. It's annoying. Are you going to the trash heap? Is it going to have bones in it? Yep. Naked mole puppy bones. Well, that's fun. Let's see what else he's going to grab. A downward passage. That's a little concerning as well. Oh, that's fine. It's just a downward passage into... Gabro downward slope. I wonder how we discovered that. We're not even mining over there. 
We're working on getting the woodcutters to where they need to be. Well, I mean, good for you guys. I'm proud. Now, how's that tunnel? Oh, yeah. Open space straight down into lava. Good. All the way up. Damn it! I was about to click! Usurushirslug! Astatung! A copper goblet. Amazing, amazing stuff. I doubt this channel will be as simple as this. There's gonna be caverns in the way. Well, that will be right over lava the whole time. And then a stairwell all the way up next to it. Which doesn't sound scary at all. Jesus, it's just a hole. Tower cap cap. Ooh, look at these dangerous trees. Chop those down. like that. Cut across there. Over to that. Doo -doo. Give me the mushrooms. No! That is the indoor swimming pool. I can only imagine how many people are just going to slip and fall and just plummet to their death. So I'll have to designate a place for, like, bones and things, because people do, like, crafting with those. But, like, other nonsense needs to be hucked into this pit. Now we could maybe start trying to harness some lava. Plenty of food, plenty of drink. It's been a pretty quiet fort. Let bones pile up at the butcher shop. There's no miasma that way. I mean, that's probably where most of the bones are being kept, honestly. Let's take a look. Butcher shop. It has nothing in it. It's kind of surprising. There's a flounder at the fish shop. A pair of raw fish. Come on. You got one light right, right there. Bunch of millet over in the still. Both are confusing and angry. Yeah, college and the DMV are both frustrating. In different ways, though. Keep you on your toes. Just disable bones from the refuse pile. Listen. Do it. I don't care if it's going to get a little water. Uh, 
The water's gonna go someplace else. It'll be fine. Man, look at him go. He's outpacing the water. The fish shop's floundering, you could say. <laughs> I'm making a hole that goes from the surface of the world all the way down into lava. Just a sheer pit. Then we could just huck trash down the hole. Had a Noida turn out. Uh, I ended up using uh, Gigasaw, and I died because I used Gigasaw. Man, he is tearing through this. <coughs> Conquered your fear saws. And what did it get me? I died. I learned the fear saws more. Okay, I think I think we have a sheer hole that goes all the way down. Open space. My god, we do! It's a straight shot from the surface all the way down. Oh, uh, wait, wait. There's one interrupting hole here. Uh-oh. Okay, the scary wall's been discovered. Section of caverns collapsed. What? Oh, that's fine. That was that was the point. Unusual volcanic wall studded with gems. Diamond cluster. Here's the circus wall. Tetrahydrite. Diamonds. Diamonds. Rubies. Black diamonds. Fire snake. Doop doo doop doop doo. Glory hole in the circus wall. Honk, honk. Wait, why was it going that way? <laughs> I don't even remember what that wall was for. Anyway. Back to the important task of making a pit I can huck garbage into. Yeah, do it. Do it! Come on, baby. The miner is fighting. I don't like that. Farmer, dwarven child. Come on, look at that goblet. Okay, let's see here. Open space. Water? How is that possible? Shit. 
shouldn't be any water. It should just be a hole to go straight down. Unless I fucked it up somehow. Yes, do it! Mist, mist, mist. I think it's the one tile of water falling is what I'm seeing right now. We should be able to see the water hit the lava. Yeah, there it is! Pshh. Section of caverns collapsed. That's not real. Don't worry. Panicking about nothing. It's just more water splashing in, don't worry. Alright, let's go look at this magnificent goblet. Oh, I got moved! This is a copper goblet. All craft's dwarf ship is of the highest quality. It's encrusted with square-cut rose quarters and encircled with bands of copper. This object menaces with spikes of naked moral dog bone. Delicious. Alright, we have a pit that goes straight down into Lava Town. Uninterrupted. Sheer hole going straight ass down. Where it's still leaking water. And I'm going to get a section of caverns collapsed over and over again because of it. Even though nothing's collapsing. So now I need to figure out, how do we, like, designate this as a dump? So people just huck garbage in there. How do you make it so they throw things in a hole? It's really gonna tell me a section of the caverns collapsed over and over again. That's going to be a little annoying. Although maybe it's done. First you name one of your dwarves garbage. Then... Oh my god, we could, we could capture goblins in cages and literally throw them down a shaft that goes all the way down. I'm very excited about that. Alright, so make a zone. Not a... Ah, uh, garbage dump. Uh -huh. Garbage dump. Except... My, my. So we gotta be careful. If we mark something as garbage, that's where it's going. All right, we got a garbage dump made. I'm t should I put like a door around, like make this a little shed? God, it looked like someone threw themselves in. I hope she's just taking the stairs. That's such a scary thing for you to do. It's a staircase that's just next to doom. That frightens me a little bit. How's our platform doing? Oh, we're almost done. Come on. I still have no wood. This is very confusing. I guess I could up the priority on cutting down those mushrooms down there. But really, like, once this is done, a lot of workers will be available again, and I'll just occupy it out. Grow trees. What do I look like? An elf? That's elf shit. We place a dumping zone next to a tile with a lower z-level to throw it down the tile. So like right now, this tile is the dump zone and it's just a sheer hole straight down. 
So I assume they'll huck it down there? Like, maybe I could designate something as trash just to see what happens. Boulder. I want to I want to huck something down there. But what? Copper spear? Copper axe? Is that a crutch? Oh, the crutch is the perfect test. Throw a little Timmy's crutch down the well. I'm sorry, are these things moving? You saw that, right? This moved. They're moving! Why is stuff moving? They're on pebbles. That's weird. It's moving on its own! If you're doing something outside, you need to enable outdoor garbage hauling. How do I enable outdoor garbage hauling? Why are these things moving? It's creeping me out. Oh my god! I went from attracting no migrants to I just got so many! I went from 28 to 60! That's over 30 of them! What the hell? Well, that's very disappointing. We don't have any way to deal with that right now. The Wear Monitor! Ficard Sebrex has come, a large monitor lizard twisted in a humanoid form. It is as crazed for blood and flesh. Its eyes glow green. Its raw umber scales are jagged and set far apart. Now you will know why you fear the night. See, this is worse than a beast triple strike. This is way worse than a than a beast. This is a wear thing. Anyone it hits will turn into wear things. We have to like quarantine everybody. Requires a guild. Man, I went from like no people to 60 people and a wear monster showing up. Oh boy. Anyone who bites, but yeah, this is a fort killer if you don't handle it right. Yeah. Where where things are the worst. They're scary. Get your super soldiers. We have no soldiers. I haven't even like put doors on the fucking fort. We don't even have normal soldiers. Fuck, that is, that is a scary looking thing. I'm sorry, he has two lovers? Well, time to start over. No, no, we could, we could save this. Wow, wow, why is he so close to the fort? I thought we would have a little bit of time. Well, shit. If we tell everyone to run and hide in here. <laughs> <coughs> My dwarves didn't notice them in time. Okay, assign everybody to this place. Run, oh shit, run! Suspend this burrow. I hate- I really wish it was just a button that's on and off. I, I always get confused. <laughs> 
draft everybody and just talk by. Uh, you're not allowed to go to workshops. And it's on right now? It's on right now. That's paused, that's unpaused. So in theory, everyone's gonna rush to this burrow as quickly as possible. Then we can just lock the door. Wow, what a trooper. This dude's beelining it for the monitor lizard. Doomed. Dude has two kids. Oh my god, oh my god, people are just being heroes here. We don't have weapons. I don't think the burrow's off. Did they... did they win? I think they won. Fikad Sabrek, swear monitor, is transformed into a dwarf. Where's Fikad? Why do you not have any weapons after two years? Well... We were just trying to make class inequality happen, and I didn't have any... M I had no migrants until literally 10 minutes ago, when suddenly 30 people showed up with a wear monitor. Where is this facade bastard? Well, he got away. Shit. That was, that was a mistake to even worry about him. Because now we have a bigger problem. Seriously injured. We gotta look at their injury reports. Indefatigable. First finger, right hand is mangled, lower arm's cut open. Does she have any bite marks? He might have been a migrant, he may have come in. Oh yeah, combat log. <laughs> One of the lizard man elites. All right, Fakad Sabrex was the bad man. They're gone. Farmer Munez is fighting. Farmer punches, farmer misses, attacks the farmer. Scratches the farmer, bruises the muscle. So scratched but not bit. Ah, uh, look at Fakad's combat log. That's smart. You're smart. Well, Fakad's not on the screen anymore. I don't know if I can look at his combat log. Well, that's that's annoying. Sh Chef Pigo, you got it. Well, we can't look at Fakad's log anymore. Naked Mole Dog doesn't matter to me. A wild Boar doesn't matter. Doomed. Alright, grabs the peasant, peasant misses, locks the peasant's left shoulder. Misses, grabs, grabs, charges, collides. Strikes the peasant. Strikes the peasant, strikes, kicks, pulls. Scratches, strike, strike, kick. Strike, strike. Strike. All right, no bites. Quarantine everyone together. I mean, if we just take a quick look and see, like, if someone's bitten, that's the only person we have to throw into the hole. And then put them somewhere <laughs> with a chair and make them your bookkeeper. Not a bad idea. They'll only be inaccessible for the full moon. All right, stone crafter. Attack, strikes... Misses, attacks, attacks, strikes. 
Attacks, misses, misses, bites. Okay. Who is this here? Stonecrafter? Leacot. Lycot. Well, poopers. Every fort I've ever ever had has had someone named Dishmab, and he's always been an asshole. <laughs> Let's see here. Lycot. Lycott's going to be a bookkeeper, locked into a small room where they're never allowed to leave. Yeah, they got upgraded to management. Can they starve to death? That's the real question. They can't starve to death yet. No, he's permanently going to be a bookkeeper then. Alright, next up, fish cleaner. Strikes, attacks, 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 strikes. Fish cleaner looks sick. Scratches. Strikes. Twists. Strikes. 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 Scratches. Twists. Strikes. Pulls. Scratches. Strikes. Strikes. Mr. Clancy, what's going on? Thank you for that raid. How was your stream? Welcome, raiders. I'm Chris here at Shake the Box. Uh, we were playing Noida earlier, it was a good time, and now we are trying to create an, a nice luxury fort on the ocean. Where only the rich and powerful will live, and the rest of the stinking masses will live in the dirty, dirty fort. However, a wear monitor lizard recently showed up, and uh, now we're trying to figure out who got bit. Because those people are now infected with wear monitor disease. Man, this dude got fucked up. Bends, twists, pulls. But no bites so far. Wretches, vomits, wretches, vomits, wretches, vomits. Aren't you looking at your monitor? <laughs> you disgust me. <laughs> All right, the fish cleaner's safe. Animal caretaker, did you get bit? Attack, attack, attack. Scratch, pull, punch, bend. No bites. So far, only one person's been bitten. All right, the farmer. Attack, attack, strike. Miss, attack, scratch. Strike, oh, we got another bite. So that was the farmer Cyril. Uh, take out my notepad here. I use I use real paper for these situations for some reason. That's Cyril of us. That's two down. All right, farmer Frankie Munez is the last one to worry about. Scratch, attack, pull, attack. All right, we got two people who are going to have to be locked away. Yeah, the character creator in Baldur's Gate 3 is a little disappointing that you cannot make horrible, horrible monsters. All right, someone told me we cannot dump things into my pit if they're outside. How do we enable outdoor dumping? And now let's find a nice, pl nice place to lock these two. They're going to be our, our management now. They'll never leave, though. Quality soundboard content? Thank you. I got all the important ones. <laughs> Somewhere in the job screen, alright. Uh, work orders? No. Tasks? Creatures, tasks, labor. Explosion? That is Megumin from Kanasuba. First, you repeal public indecency laws. Standing orders? 
Here we go. Automate tannery. Automate kitchen. Yes, yes. Automatically clean. Automatically butcher. Slaughter. Collect webs. Use any cloth. Weave. Hauling. Workers gather animals, food, furniture, bodies, minerals, wood. Refuse and dumping. Workers gather refuse. Workers ignore. No. Gather outdoor refuse. Ignore outdoor vermin remains. That you could ignore. Save corpses, save skulls, bones. That sounds fun. All right, now that we've experienced the fear of being attacked, it's time to build a drawbridge. Keep us safe. You can make that out of Gabro, bro. Cut gems is complete. Cavern collapsing is not real. Get rid of the fight log. Get rid of the monster log. Get rid of the uncomplete log and the weather log. Dwarven child cancer store item and bin drop off inaccessible. <laughs> X 86, 81, 73. This one kid! Mebzuth? Where's Mebzuth? I'm getting a little concerned for Mebzuth. What are you doing, buddy? Just standing there, staring at the wall, doing nothing. Oh! Oh! Turn that off. That's why. Whoopsies. Okay, outdoor hauling's enabled. I would really like to see this get hooked. It still creeps me out that it's moving on its own outside. Come on, someone throw that in the hole. I dug a pit that goes from the surface all the way down into lava, and I want to watch someone throw something in it. Come on, someone grab it. Why is all this stuff moving? It's creeping me out. But the waves are all the way over here. You can see the mist. I mean, it has to be from that. It's a little weird. It's got the little uh, little trash can symbol on it. Toggle the dump status. Yeah, it's marked for dumping. I mean, I imagine it's just low priority. They are busy working on the luxury ocean side. Uh, Oceanside Fortress that the rich people will get to work on. Sorry, live on. These people get to work on it. Only the rich get to actually be there. I don't know why we're making class inequality part of this fort. Oh my god, they're gonna cut down the tree. It's been ages. It's a tall one, so a lot of wood's about to show up. Ah. They'll get to it. Check if there's a job for it. I'm in over here. Labor. Standing orders? No, just normal orders. Work orders, labor tasks. Here we go. <coughs> Diagnose patient. Oh, yeah, I gotta make a medical dwarf. A lot of construct buildings, of course. Store items in bins. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm seeing in here. How about now? You in there now? I really should work on that hospital, though. Especially now that people got roughed up. Ah, uh, we'll figure this out. But first... They're just on the floor. The injured people are just on the floor. Are you sure you have the dump zone set up correctly? I mean, it's marked as a dump. Garbage dump. Guess what I could do is... We can disable this one. Go down one Z level. Go 
Garbage dump. Needs to be next to the hole, not over it? Or over... Or both over and next to it. I think Gomper said if you make it one Z level down, they'll throw it into the hole to reach it. Let's see if that does it. Just as a test. Dump it. Because when I make it one tile wide as a dump zone, they'll just, like, pile an infinite amount on one little tile, but they do it on the tile. I've never done, like, a pit, though. This is my first pit. I usually do the trick where you mark a bunch of stones and have an infinite stone pile. Make it next to the hole. All right. Do -do. Ba -ba -ba. That's not what I said. Who can remember what you said? Uh, if you place a dumping zone next to a tile with a lower Z level, to throw it down... Down the tile. Okay. I see what you mean now. Next to the hole. Gotcha, gotcha. Well, turn that off. That's weird to me. So we have to make this the dump and we'll throw it in the hole like this? What if they just put it on the floor right there? Alright. It's on this tile next to the hole. Let's see if they throw it in there. Oh god. But more importantly... Do a little, like, 3x3. Three three. And another 3x3. Three three. Basically, I gotta make a place to lock our, our wear people into forever. This penis will be where they live. Oh god, do we have doors? Alright, we have some doors. We can lock them in. Nah, I guess we just want to put them in there permanently, that's true. Throne. We'll go take a look and see if it got dumped in there, but first let's get a few more a few more chairs made. Get a few more tables made. They just need a table and a chair and do their work. I'll give them a bed too, why not? I'm I'm nice. I'm so kind. chair. Ba, 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 da, da, ba, ba, da, ba. Chair. I hope we have table. Table! And bed. No beds ready. It is not dumped, but it was paused, so that's probably why. Could you make it so you can unleash the were creatures when the next monster shows up? In theory, yes. We can make it so people run inside, we lock up the fortress, and then we hit a button to open that up. That could be doable. Oh, God. We didn't make it in time. We're already at the full moon. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Forbidden? Passable? No. Forbidden door.
Toggle the forbidden status. It is forbidden to you. It is locked and forbidden. I think they're all inside here, right? Like, both of the were monsters are in there? This might just be it now. Oh god, I pray that's where they are. Oh no, was there another location? Oh god. That's bad, okay. There they are. This tunnel goes to a dead end. That's the main staircase. Oh, it's not. It goes to the main staircase, though. There ain't no way we're stopping that in time. <laughs> we're gonna have to... Really throw some people in the hole soon, I think. Heavy bleeding, bleeding, healthy. Population's dropping. Okay, they got him. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, fuck. Okay, they're dead. They're dead. Hmm. Lycott. Lycott. Where's Lycott's log? How can I look at a dead thing's combat log? There has to be a way. I hope there were no survivors. I was hoping I'd have them entombed by now, but time goes so fast. Oh god, there were babies. Here we go. Where monitor Lycott? Right to the fall of Rome, yep. Okay. Strike, attack, attack, miss, 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 attack. Strike. Okay, there's one bite. Two bites. Wear monitor stone crafter. Three bites. Four bites. Five bites. Oh god. No. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It's such a long one. And there's a lot of bites involved. This bites. Alright. We gotta figure out all the people that are currently wearing monitors. Hopefully no children has survived. Dead, 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 bled to death. Perfect. That's a lot of good dead people. We could ban them from the fort, but also I have this chute that goes in the lava. I would love to just throw them in there. If we can figure it out. Alright. Lycott. Oh man, a good miner died too. Enod. Bite, pull, scratch, shake. I just did this, God. Oh, God. Alright, well, there's one. Could go off and make more of them, you get more later on. Yeah, we want to contain. <sighs> Alright. Well, that's one right off the bat. Enod. There were unfortunately survivors. Enod Dest. What a disaster. Uh, the clerk, Adil? Scratches, grab, bites. Amazing. 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 
Seeing people unleash were creatures on enemy army. Some people got bit and escaped. A couple sieges later, they got seized by a bunch of were creatures. Like, we could make that kind of thing happen. It might be fun. Breaks the grip. Grab. Grab. Bites. Oh my god. Everyone got bit this time. I'm gonna have so many people in a special room just for monsters. Come on, Pen. What are you doing? Cat and kill. Werebats versus werewolves. How about Domus? Domus, did you get bit, you stupid bastard? Grabs, misses, bites. Bites. Domus, no! This is Domus, Aso. Just the first three letters is enough to figure out who they are later. Aerith, how about you? I pray. God damn it! You've got to be kidding me! Our in-house ones were real, real bite happy. Man, this pen not great at writing anymore. Come on, Reg. Help me out here. Don't be bit. Strangle, strangle, strangles. Oh, they're dead. Well, that helps. Oh shit, if I go to the bottom. Bled to death? Okay, that's good. Forgot the- oh, dead? Perfect. Dead? Excellent. Okay, okay, this is turning around. I was getting worried, but actually, if you go to the bottom, most of them are dead. So far, all of them are dead. Woodcutter, Reg, how about you? You dead? Dead, perfect. Lost their only doctor. Good word. Good news. Good news. Okay, animal caretakers dead. Dwarven baby. Dead. Dead babies, everybody. I don't know why that baby jumped into a brawl. Dead. How about Frankie Munoz, the farmer? Dead. Billy Goat Child doesn't matter, but dead. Another Dwarven Child? Not dead. And this kid is the one that matters so far. This one right here, right? Yeah, Billy Goat. So, Stukos Colladrill. A lot of dead babies here today. Welcome to Shake the Box, Dead Babies. Okay, we got a child so that's gonna have to be locked away for the rest of their lives. That's fun. Real lighthearted content. Wear monitor, like hot. Fish cleaner, how about you? Dead, I like it. My miner over here. Dead, perfect, and... Carol's the one I locked in the room, right? Well, Christ, okay. We're still- there's still only two. There's only two still. <laughs> we got that going for us. Because one of these wear monitors died in this encounter. Yeah, there's one child that got bit. And they're the one goddamn survivor, apparently. The circus would cheer people up. Listen, we gotta we gotta get the fort on the ocean built. We don't have time for the circus right now. We're being haunted. That's the fastest haunting ever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Thirteen, sixteen. That 
That math's right, I think. Oh, God. All right, I have a slab. Let's go ahead and engrave that slab with Rith. And then make slabs as well. Like, we're going to need more slabs. I might as well just do it as a work order. Jesus. We're going to need a bunch. Slab. Okay. Well... So which, which werewolf are you? You're Carol. So Lycott's the one that died. So we need to lock Stukas away forever and Serral Avuz away forever. Lycott died. Everyone loves the circus. I know, I know. Cavern collapse. Didn't really happen, though. Gonna make this an office. And this belongs to... Cyril. Where are you, Cyril? Guess what you are now, Cyril. You're going to be doing paperwork for the rest of your forever life. Bookkeeper? I'm sorry, that's going to... That's going to Cyril now. They'll get better at it with time, I'm sure. Let's go ahead and unforbid this door. Do, 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 do. And there's Sarah in her new office. Someone please put a Gabro wall up there. Do, do, do. Entomb them forever! Goddamn disaster. Gotta get that hospital up and running. I'm sure there are injured people still. Actually, I think when the wear monitor lizards happened, they probably killed all the people that were in the hospital, so never mind. They're fine. They're, they're, they got cured the ultimate way. The one true cure that lasts forever. Come on, do this wall up. Take your time with the saving. Do, do, do. One day adventure mode is going to come out and I'll have a lot of fun visiting all these horrible, horrible fortresses. Come on. Come on, someone do it. So I'll put the wall on. Are you a ghost? Nope, you're just a peasant walking slowly. <clears throat> Come on, get that wall built. Are you just having a sit down? Just came all the way around for that one random ass thing. Come on. Whoa, but I'm look tired. 
I'm afraid this guy's gonna, like, bust on out. Gonna walk away. I'll probably build the door faster. Needs door? Oh my god. Sleep, drink, sleep, store item. Store, 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 rest, pick up equipment, construct building, floor, 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 floor. Oh, here he is! Here's our man! Taking the longest possible route to do it. Good, good. That's what I like to see. Look forward to that person not being there when we're ready for it. Alright, they're still in there. Ooh, we got someone possessed. Oh yeah, I should take care of that ghost, shouldn't I? Do -do 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 -do. Let's put that ghost to rest. It'll be small to start, but... We'll have a little space for... for... slabs here. There we go. Get him out of here. Alm, what's up? Are you my man building the wall? I think he's my man! He's almost there! It's gonna happen! Alright, no more ghosts. Oh my fucking god, it happened. Like, they finally got almost there and the person walked out. Uh, suspend the construction. Gotta wait for them to be back in there. Jesus Christ, we're almost there. Hur hurry up, please. How are we gonna deal with the child? Stukos. They're playing make-believe. I guess I can make this their- their bedroom? Can we- do we have beds yet? Don't need beds yet. I guess I'll still make it their room. We just need them to be in there. We just need a space that's just theirs. Here, it's an office and it's just for you, kiddo. I don't think I'm allowed to make a child have an office. No, there he is, Stukos. Like, we gotta do this before the next moon happens. <coughs> In theory, they'll... The kid will hang out in here if it's their space, right? Right? Oh my god, it's so close. I might expel them from the fortress just to... ...keep us safe right now. Because it's about to happen. Stukos is attending meeting! Oh, you're not allowed to expel a child? Oh, no! How do you deal with a kid who's infected with, uh, werewolfism?
scientifically rate the best starter in each Pokemon generation. All in all, I always knew water was the best type without doing any empirical study. I usually go with fire myself. Oh, I'm very concerned. How do we mark him as trash? Like, I would do it if I knew how. Oh, God. Okay, they're back in their office at the very least. Resume construction. Please go quick. Are they going to build it? No. Suspend construction. No! Fuck! And a party's happening! Oh, no, no, no. Alright, I'm expelling them. That's one where person taken care of. Okay, the kid. The kid's the problem now. Stukos. What did Stukos grow up or something? Where's Stukos? Stukos. 